If you are younger than 50 years old and have had a DVT or PE, is it a good idea for you to get tested for Factor V Leiden disorder? If you have had more than one thrombosis occurrence, then it is also recommended that you get tested for Factor V Leiden disorder. A test a simple sample usually requires blood to be drawn from a vein in your arm. I'll provide a photo from the content article in the next clip and you can find the link in the description. Sometimes, an evaluation for the presence of a Factor V mutation can begin with a test for activated protein C resistance. Though it is not commonly performed, about 90% of the APC resistance is due to Factor V Leiden mutation. Studies have found a significant association between Factor V Leiden mutation and miscarriages. Some people ask whether patients with Factor V Leiden mutation should be on long-term anticoagulation therapy. The answer is no. According to the article, anticoagulation therapy is used when there is a DVT or v VTE present. Long-term therapy should be only considered for specific individuals depending on specific situations. The fact that a person has Factor V Leiden mutation does not change the intensity or duration of anticoagulation therapy. If you would like to learn more about Factor V Leiden testing, please follow the link in the description.